How to Stop Your PC From Automatically Changing Audio Device When you resume your PC after a period of standby, and you try to play a video clip or music and you realize there is no sound because Windows has automatically changed audio device. A temporary workaround to solve this problem is to change your audio device manually from the taskbar. Or to open device manager and click on scan for hardware changes and of course this is very frustrating. But after long researches, I found out that the best solution for this problem is to schedule a Windows task to do that automatically for you every time you start your PC or every time you resume the system from standby. To schedule a task, click on the search in the taskbar and type schedule. Then right click on task scheduler and choose run as administrator. From the top, click on action then click create task. Here we will write the name of the task and description. Refresh audio device. We will change that to run whether user is logged on or not. And then tick run with highest privileges. Then change that to Windows 10 or Windows 11 or whatever operating system you are using. Next click on Triggers tab to tell Windows what event will trigger this command to execute. Click New. We want this task to run every time we start Windows and every time we resume the system from standby. Here we'll choose at Startup. Then tick this box Repeat Task every 1 minutes for a duration of 5 minutes. Change that to stop task if it runs for more than 10 minutes. Then click OK. Now we need to add one more trigger to run the task on resume from standby status. Click new again. This time we will choose on Workstation Unlock. Do the same thing again and click OK. Now it's time to tell Windows which action you want to run when those conditions happen. Click New. Start a program. In this box, type the following command. And click OK. Now click on Settings tab. We will tick this box, if the task fails, restart every one minute, attempts to restart, three times. Make sure you tick this box if it is not ticked. Stop task if it runs longer than, one hour.
and click OK. Enter your Windows password. And that's it. Now hopefully you won't have to manually change your audio device every time you log into Windows. If you find this video helpful, please share, subscribe and write your comment. Have a good day.